Hello everyone, welcome back to another game of Dominion Online. Let's just dive in, and we got S, S, I saw an S and a Y in the name, that's all I know, the Stick Sticks. Oh, there's Arata on Hovel? It looks the same to me. Okay. And on Port? Okay, maybe they just, I don't, don't, don't tell me about those cards. So instead of Estates, we have Shelters this game. Cool, first time having that. So we must be in a Dark Ages set? What's an astrolabe? Three bucks, a coin and a buy today and tomorrow. Shantytown, Caravan, Conclave. Two coins. You can play an action if you don't already have a copy of it. Okay. So I don't see any attacks, but there's pretty good village buys and stuff. Oh, Butcher. Haven't gotten to play with Butcher in a while. You get, you have buys. I mean, it must be worth doing some kind of engine-y thing here. Um, I should probably also grab a shanty town, right? Yeah, shanty town caravan should be a fine opening, or maybe shanty town conclave. No. Oh yeah, why not? Because if they collide, you can just play the Conclave first, even though it's not a terminal. Or sorry, it is a terminal, but it's not if you manage to play um, something you don't have a copy of. So um, I'm going to want buys eventually. What is this again? Galleria. So it gives you buys when you gain cheap cards. What did opponent buy? Oh, Wharf, they had five bucks. Boo. <clears throat> so, is there anything... Butcher gains you stuff mid-turn, but you don't really want to spend it on threes and fours? I mean... It's okay for fours. Maybe. Grab that Wharf now. At least we got it into the shuffle. I think another caravan is okay, but a conclave is probably better. Ugh, pretty terrible start. So we play the Conclave on Caravan to get us an action, although we don't really need it. Yeah, I guess we might as well play the Caravan first. Seems like this game is going pretty badly. I need more wharves, but I also need a butcher. Right? What am I doing with a butcher? I guess butcher is worse with these shelters because they are they have a cost of one instead of two. Oops, almost clicked port there. I don't really want a port. I feel like we've both been doing the exact same thing and opponents just gotten a little bit luckier with their draws. I picked up a caravan where they picked up their second conclave before I did. Maybe that helped them get the five, you know, the wharf a little sooner and then the expand a little sooner. This is horrible. I don't know about all these expands, though. I feel like Butcher is probably better. It's kind of bad. Oh, you know what? Expand is actually good to trash your shelters. I'll pick one of those up.
Because it can get you four costs out of them. Let's see. Conclave won't, for some reason, stay out in play if you play it with Worf like a throne room would. Double checking. Yeah, they trashed the Overgrown Estate and got a caravan out of it, indeed. Ugh. Ah, I was about to play Conclave and Wharf, but no, I have a Wharf in play. Don't do that. Yeah, I mean, I don't really want this Necropolis that badly. This is so bad. I think a butcher? No, it's probably just more wharves. Buy like port caravan here. Maybe, I'm not sure. I haven't paid that much attention to what their deck needs. Okay. Wharf Shantytown. Okay, fine. I guess I can only play this on Shantytown. So that's eight bucks. Could buy a province trashing my hovel. It's not horrible. But I think I need like more wharves, right? And after that, I might as well. I think I actually want a silver because I don't have that much money in this deck. I'm surviving just on my coppers and some a couple conclaves. No, hmm. I need to make the deck more reliable before I start adding payload to it. I feel like I bought this estate an hour ago, and this is the first time I'm drawing it. Not estate, expand. And I don't know why, when I was thinking about buys, I only thought about Galleria and Astrolabe, but of course Wharf gives you buys. You just have like as many buys as you want if you have Wharves, usually. Oh. Yeah, they gained a Wharf, shuffled it in, and then I think drew it. This could be one of the ones they already had, but no, now they've drawn... But they have five Wharves, though, right? There's still one more in their deck somewhere? Yeah, there it is. Oh dear. There's wharf number six, so I'm stuck on four. Mystic seems weird. What's that all about? Huh, not sure. I guess I can, yes, good, perfect. So I can expand this. Draws another conclave, fine. Um, I guess I want another port. 
Oh, but shoot, drawing a conclave means that now when I, if I play the shanty town, it won't draw. No, that's too bad. This is so bad. All right, let's just get another expand. This is sickening. Opponent has twice as much hand as they have deck, so they should have no trouble. I feel like they probably shouldn't have played all the wharves last turn. So that they could try to get three wharves every turn instead of four and two alternating. I don't remember how important it was for them to draw their whole deck. I don't know, maybe two wars is enough to draw the whole deck anyway. In which case, sure, go for it. I wonder if Hovel's errata used to be about you had to buy victory cards instead of gain them. I don't think so. Let's look that card up. Dominion. Hovel. Uh, yes, it did used to say when you buy a victory card. Now it says when you gain. I feel like there have been multiple cards. Like Farmlands was also eroded. It used to say buy, and now it says gain. And I noticed in the article for Farmlands, it said they made this change to avoid some kind of loop involving buys. I don't understand. I don't know what card would cause that loop. Clearly, one I haven't seen yet. I mean, this I could resign. I think, but maybe opponent is. Going to carelessly get very close to emptying out all the piles and let me empty them and gain an estate to win? Seems unlikely. <clears throat> A province just to be safe. <clears throat> just in case your opponent manages to do something for a change. All right, I, I give up. You win. This, this deck sucks, and their deck is great. I don't know what happened in this game. Like, they were just able to buy fives and sevens way before I was, or at least, I don't know about way, but noticeably before I was. You know, was it really the second Conclave that they picked up a little earlier? Maybe. I don't think that should have been that significant. But it probably was better than my caravan, so I guess I can't be too mad that they got exactly what they deserved for choosing a better opening. They kept their Necropolis as well, which, whatever. I don't know if they did that on purpose or if they just never lined up and expand with it. I don't think it's an especially good card on that board. There are some games where, like, you don't have any villages, but you have an Acropolis, so you're like, I gotta keep this, it's the only thing that lets me play two terminals in a turn. Here, with plenty of ports and shanty towns, I don't think it was that great. Hmm. I don't know, they just had way more of everything somehow. Well, good game. Hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.